Hey guys, so in today's video, I will be showing you a tutorial on how to get your back walkover. Um, on my video, on my gymnastic videos, I think I'm now going to be wearing my leotard other than outside because I'm not sure if you guys are aware, but if you want to take a look outside, this is my house. Outside, everything is all snow. Um, well, there is, it's not really focusing, but my trampoline's right over there. It's covered with a layer of snow, like one layer, because I literally shoveled my trampoline. I don't know if you guys saw it, but on my last video, I did a gym tour. And make sure to go check that out so you guys can ask me for skills. I have a balance beam, a mini tramp, um, a soft mat, and a harder mat. So yeah, let's get started. So first, you're going to want to stretch. Obviously, you're going to need to stretch. So we'll start from there. So first, you're going to take, do this kind of stretch to just open up your arms a little bit more. Okay. And then we're going to reach down also. I usually forget that. Okay. Now, you can sit down in a straddle on the floor. I don't go with it. Okay. Okay. <laughs> like this. Lean over to one side. Lean over to the other side. Grab your two angles, so like right here, and lean forward. Okay. Now, if you have, you could do your bridge first. Um, if you have a back bend, I, you might want to wait to do that to do your bridge first. So we'll do that. Okay, back to our bridge, as I was saying before. Rock back and forth just to stretch out your back. And then kick over. And if you don't have your back, if you don't have your bridge kick over or your back bend kick over, um, you might want to learn that before you do a back walk over because you definitely will need to be able to do a back bend, which looks like that. And then you will need to be able to do that and kick over. It doesn't matter if it's straight um, or not because it just matters if you can kick over. Okay, so so after you practice that a couple of times, you should be able to do stretch out your back like we just did. And then you should be able to do your back bend. So do your back bend as I just did. Do some kick over, kick over a couple of times and go back and forth. And if you're not ready for that, you can always add some pillows to give it more cushion. And yeah, as you do that, you can, I'll show you guys this. So you put your dominant foot in front of you. So my dominant foot's my right foot. And then your bad foot behind you. Your dominant foot in front of you should be like this. Pointed toes with your foot up. Okay, so like that. And then, then go back. You need to be able to go back into a back bend and go right over in your side. So like, it might be easy, easier on a cheese mat, I'm not sure. So, it looks like this. We'll also give you guys another view of this so you can see it a little bit better. Whoa, that might also happen. Um, if you lose balance on your hand and your hands start to move around, you might go to the side, but you will get it. Okay, I'm gonna try that one more time. Those are the views, and yeah. So that's how you get your back walk over. You basically just need to keep practicing a back bend kick over, and just put your foot in front of you with the pointed toe like that, and then go back bend, and then you could also stop and then kick over, or you could just try and then just fall down. Whatever suits you. Um, make sure you have a mat to do this on, because normal floor might hurt your wrist. Um, 
sometimes after I do this, I do get some pain in my wrist, um, which is why you need wrist support. I will be getting a wrist support um, sometime next week, so I will show you those. You can get them from Tiger Paws on Amazon or another website. Um, they're just made by the brand Tiger Paws, and yeah, they're called wrist supports. So basically, that's the end of our video. Don't forget to like, subscribe, and comment. Um, and yeah, and I, um, I got comments before on a leotard fashion show. I'm not a competitive gymnast yet because I'm only a level three and need to be a level five. And yeah, so I don't have more than one. This is my only leotard. Actually, I do have another one upstairs. Um, so yeah, one leotard and one pair of shorts. That's basically it. So yeah, no leotard fashion show. I'm sorry, guys. But you can also comment down below anything else. I will probably be doing, um, it's over there. I will probably be doing a mini tramp, um, introducal right over there. That's my mini tramp. And yeah. So thanks for watching today's video. Don't forget to like, subscribe, and comment. Read the description. And we love you. Bye, guys.